Hey everyone, this is Vicki from Messy Table again. Um, I'm trying to adjust the light. It is 9.30 at night. So I'm back with my... Whoops, put this in here. Let me get this light out of our faces. There we go. I watercolored the green accordion. You know, the ones that the black and white houses were on. This... And um, I did, I colored, if you can see my desk, sorry. It's kind of a mess right now. Um, I did all the houses and the trees, and I'm putting the trees separate up here from the houses so that I don't want to keep repeating trees when I do it. I have some trees that are duplicates. I want to make sure that I um, space the trees out so not two, two same trees are in the same place. And he, well, I can't spread those out because I have nowhere else to go with the houses. Urgh. All right, so here are the houses. And where's the ATG gun? Underneath six feet of paperwork. Okay, here's the ATG gun. Um, until I decide that these guys will be in a permanent spot, I think what I'm going to do is use the ATG first, and then later what I might do is go back with glue and rip them out and then peel the ATG stuff off and then glue them because I had to move a couple around that interfered you know they overlapped and like bumped each other in the thing so the the folding up was not smooth so I think maybe what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the ATG first then I'm gonna go back and glue them because I don't want any screw-ups <laughs>
house um, theme, I need a house. So I had these really big stamps from Woodware Craft Collection Clear Magic Singles, is what it's called. And there's only three houses that came in there because I don't have any stamps on the back of it. So there were only three houses that came in there. I have this one, and unfortunately, I did not save the packaging that went with it. But this is lovely cityscape, and this would make a nice front for it. Then there's this one. Did I save the packaging for this one? No. Okay, so this has all kinds of different houses. There's a little stripy house and this cute little cottage looking house. Then there's these guys. They're adorable. There's another little tea tiny house that's flipped over in there, but these are all cute little things that go on houses like the awning, curtains, the welcome mat, a window box with flowers. This would make a nice front. Not really sure if this is going to be tall enough. I don't think it is to make. No, it's not. I can already tell by looking at it. Fold this up and this is not going to be tall enough. But if I do some kind of um, some like grass and a tree or something to fill it in to elevate it on the, the cardboard that this could be the cover for this one right here. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop the camera now and try to decide. It is 6.30 in the morning, so decisions might take a little longer than normal. I've already had two cups of coffee, but <laughs> I don't think that's gonna make any difference in how long it takes me to decide. Um, anyway, so this is what I wanna try. I, I think I would like to try this one right here, or maybe this one. This one, not so much, but one of these two. Or do the more urban-looking cityscape that kind of goes along with this. I don't know. I really think that these would be much cuter. So I think these are what I'm going to go with. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stamp... I'm going to stamp the, let's see if I can use this for my front cover, my cover, and stamp the house on here. And I still need an inside cover and another inside cover for like both sides of the inside cover. So maybe I can use this one on the outside, use this one on the inside, and then save this one for the belly band. Yeah, or I could do the inside, do this on the outside, and I think that's what I'm going to do. I think what I would do is I will just stamp the cityscape for the inside cover, this for the outside, and save one of these two for the belly band. Yeah, okay, I got a plan. All right, I'll be right back while, oops, big shadows. I will be right back while I get this going, and we'll carry on. Please stay tuned for the Cityscape Flag Book number three video and number four. That will follow after I upload number two. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Bye.